I cannot believe that this of all things was my most enjoyable new gameplay experience of the week. I pre-registered for it. I downloaded it. I waited at least a week to play it. I opened up the game. I questioned my judgment when I pre-registered for it in the first place. I opened up the game. I said this is going to be 15 seconds before I delete the game. 15 seconds goes by, 30 seconds, a minute, 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes. I'm like, okay, I didn't give this game enough credit. I I don't know if that means that the game is amazing or the rest of the games that have come out in the past couple weeks were absolute garbage. I think it's mostly the other games being absolute garbage and this being kind of a little bit better than I gave it credit for when I first downloaded it. So, uh, let me stop talking. Let's go. I mean, I'm going to continue talking, but let's see some actual gameplay. So, this is Guns Up Mobile. I'm sure you already figured that out from clicking on it. It is kind of like a... It's not a tower defense game. It's like the opposite of a tower defense game. So you start out the game here, as you can see, with your little truck. You deploy your little soldiers over there. By the way, there's a thing that my face is. It's just the uh, the the your your troop count that I'm uh, that I'm covering up. So you basically you just d deploy your troops. They go. They attack the enemies. It's it's the opposite of a tower defense game. It's a tower off game so right now we are attacking uh, <laughs> our offense game wow uh, so right now we're attacking just enemy uh, uh, enemy bases these are other players bases this is just like still early game this is not any crazy complex bases uh, this is kind of like a you know it's kind of like mechanic wise like Clash Royale and those other kind of card based battler games because all of these cards down uh, all of these cards down here you do have your energy over here um, you do have these little troops that you deploy, and all of the troops are are basically cards. I mean, they call them cards regardless of whether or not they're cards. You upgrade them, you give them, you make them stronger, you give them more stats. Of course, we know these games have already been out on mobile, things like this, in the past, where you upgrade the things, you get the loot boxes, and that's how you get the pieces of the, the units, and then you upgrade them that way. And then, of course, you need all the legendary stuff because those are the best, most OP things if you want to climb in ranks. Excuse me. I, I feel like this game is going to be more of the same as far as that's concerned. By the way, this was already... Um, this is kind of a sequel to the game. The original one came out on PS4 and PC. Probably with much less micro microtransactions, but this is very similar to that game, uh, which is the original, uh, the original Guns Up. But let's take a look at some loot box. No, we don't need. We don't want to take a look at loot boxes. But this is not like this is not a game that you're going to be playing for eight years every single day. This is like one of those games like. You're waiting for something. You pop. Uh, you, you you pop the phone out. You're like, okay, what do I want to like? You're like, okay, did I spend a lot of time on TikTok this week? Well, let me get not not me personally. I'm talking about you guys. Um, well, let me go at, or YouTube, whatever. Uh, let me go. Let me open up a game. Let me have a little bit of fun. Super quick battles. You jump in. You do some stuff. You open up some boxes. I mean, it's it's a mobile game, right? It's a tried and true mobile game. But there's not like a crazy. Some of these games. Like like this that I, I appreciate because sometimes I just want to get in, get out. I only have a couple minutes and I want to just tinker around with something. Not really go too crazy with like um, end game hyper competitive like mobile game esports. I'm like, I just want to have some fun for a couple minutes. Open up the game and be in some kind of battle having like playing the game within a few uh, a few minutes of of actually opening the app. So that's uh, that's one of the things that I appreciate is that you can just hop into the game fairly quickly. Also, that we are actually playing a game. Because a lot of these mobile games out now are idle games and play your, like, you just watch the game being played. And I'm kind of tired of that, to be honest. I'm kind of tired of the, like, pay attention to this story that you obviously, like, that you don't care about because we just threw it together and we didn't care about it uh, either. And then watch the game play itself. It's like, why why am I playing a game for that? Like, this is an actual game. Like, I, I appreciate the fact that that these are actual, like, you actually play the game here. It's, I feel like my bar is so low nowadays. Gotcha games destroyed me. 
Oh my god, the bar is so, so very low. But like I said, this is like, you, you of course, open up the loot boxes to get the upgrades for all your units. Let's open up some loot boxes. Now, I don't think we have, um, and then, oh, we have some uh, city builder aspects. I mean, it's not really, it's not crazy aggressive city builder aspects. There's just some, like, you build your base, uh, you upgrade your base. Uh, like, for example, over here, we have our main command center. Uh, I don't think we have... Yeah, we can't do that just yet. 6,400 little bullets. These are little resources. They're little resources? I don't know. They're resources of whatever size they are uh, up there. We don't have... Do we have any achievements that are going to give us bullets? No, we don't. We have a bunch of gold, but we're always capped on gold. I don't know why we're always capped on gold. Do we have any uh, loot boxes to open? We do have some units to upgrade. We can upgrade this right here. We get some more health. We get some more damage. Uh, accuracy is nice. That we, we didn't upgrade the accuracy, but uh, accuracy is nice too. There's also all of these units down here, which are the stronger, more OP things. We got the Bombardier. We got the Colonel. We got the Commando. This is the poster child of the game. We got the Sharpshooter. So, of course, all of these things, like to max them, they're going to be like... If you really want to go crazy and and be end game hashtag esports mobile game esports god, then also we have the uh, vehicles. We didn't even take a look at the the vehicles, but we have some of those commander abilities. We have vehicles over here, which I don't actually have yet. This is equipment for the different units, which you gear up on them, or you gear on them and then you upgrade after that. So it's kind of like a mixture between. I mean, it's got elements of other games as well, but I mean, mobile games always do that in general. So I was trying to get some fun new units to show you, but as with these mobile loot box games usually are, you don't get the full units, you just get little pieces of the units. So anyway, that's it for this one. Not a game you spend your entire life playing, just a game you tinker around with on the toilet every once in a while. Sounds weird to say, tinker around with on the toilet every once in a while, while we wait for some more premium new games to come out. It's been kind of dry lately. Hopefully we get some new, some good new stuff, some good potentially good new stuff is coming out in the next few months. I mean, who knows if they're going to destroy the games or not when they actually get here. It's going to be, oh, it's a nightmare. Wonderful. We had high hopes for this game. But there's some appealing ones <laughs> coming out, potentially. Anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you as always in the next one.